Hello, this is Ogma 001, and this is the next part of Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines, and we are back with some more, so we're going to go ahead and boss this. Hopefully we should be finishing this and getting the uncurrent sarcophagi back, and dealing with Mr. Gary. Luckily this chap shouldn't prove too much of a problem, because I can slow down time, which makes me a fucking beast, as you can see here. Uh, of course, there will be some hiccups, because I am not perfect. Contrary to popular belief, I know a lot of you think, Oh, that Ogma, he's such a badass, I want to do him. I know, I know. Oh, but Jesus. So yes, as you can see, my commentary is not degraded at all. Oh, good fucking move. Oh my Christ. There we go. Deary me, that, that was much harder than it needed to be. I have no idea, I apologize. But anyway, we will continue to move onwards. Sorry about that, I just had to pause it quickly. We will continue onwards, and let's numb some rats, I think. That, that's what we should probably do, because we need health. But yeah, those fat guys are really easy in big rooms like you just saw, but in rooms like this, they're a bit of a pain in the arsehole. So we're going to fuck these rats up and get some health and blood back. So although we handled that fight poorly, as you can see by consuming some little ratty bastards, we can exponentially improve how the situation is going to go for us. Come back, rats. I want to suck you off. There we go. And that's enough for me now. That, that was enough to compensate for our poor encounter. There we go. Nom nom nom. Tasty ratties. But anyway. Uh, we need to continue moving onwards. Uh, that appeared to do absolutely nothing. We didn't even need to fight those bastards. All's well that ends well. Although, although, I'm not sure. Let's go in here. See what we find. Um, game? There we go. See where we end up. Ah, good. There. This is the next section, I believe. As you can see, you can climb these. Uh, I didn't know that when I first played the game, but now you do as well. You both know. Yeah. And, yeah. Okay. I apologize. Uh, I appear to be stuck on this. Let's. Yeah. Ah, yeah. Yeah. There we go. Fantastic. And we're on. So, um, we need to continue making our way through this section. As you can see, this was the door that was locked, but I've now unlocked it with my steadfast intuition and platforming skills. So we're going to move on. And as you can see, there's a nice key in there, but we can't pick that up. And uh, this is my favorite character. It's my favorite enemy type in the game. Just because, look at that. She is a beaut. She is a beaut. Uh, but yeah, this is the Samitsi creation. But luckily, celerity makes combat a doddle. See, look at that. Now, apart from the fact that they, she can turn around relatively fast, even with my ability, because she doesn't have a turn in her attack animation, she can just turn in an instant, which makes her a bit of a pain. But as you can see, not a problem for me, because I am a badass. Zamitsi ain't got nothing on me, boy. But yeah, th that fight can be difficult. But not for me, because, as you, as you can see, I'm just good. It's just because I'm so incredibly pro at this. And because I rolled a relatively easy character to play, because I didn't even mean for this character to be as good as it was, but as you can see in combat, it just bosses it. Assuming I don't fuck up with my input, which is more often than not what causes deaths in uh, this character in particular. Yeah, but uh, if you have a ranged character, you can just rain death, but I've completely forgotten what I'm doing. Um... Let's let's uh, hop around a bit more, and hopefully we'll eventually run into something. But, uh, yes, you can see these are the people it's killed before. Am I just being a bit stupid, or nope, nope? I'm not being stupid. This is the in fact the correct way, incorrect way even. But yes, we do need to escape from these sewers because they will be the death of us. Uh, as as I've said before, these sewers are my least favorite part of the game for reasons like this. They're just the level design, and ah, uh, it's a sewer level. I mean, come on, man, sewer levels are. So cliche and overdone. And we've got some more ammo for guns I don't use. Beautiful. Beautiful. I guess if you're in that fight and it's all going tits up, that's one solution. But uh, I can't seem to remember what we're supposed to be doing here, so that's all kinds of fun. Um, no. <laughs> that's all I can say to jumping down there. Oh, oh um, ah, remember. Yes, yes, of course. It it's all comes flooding back to me. It all comes flooding back. No, uh, I, we, we're not doing that. Basically, what you want to do is go ha, ha. 
See, I'm a genius. I'm I'm actually a genius of death. There we go. And you can climb through the wall here, I think. Yeah, yes you can. And that's how you escape from that room. It took me a while to remember how to, but we got there in the end. And we need we move on to the next section. Soon we should run into uh the Nosferatu's lair, which is uh one of the more interesting areas of the game. I am going to say we are going to pick up the place running through this because I want to get it finished relatively soon so I can move on to something else. So there may be less side quests and things being done, but don't worry. Don't worry. I'm not going anywhere. I'm back for good. Well, not for good until the next set of exams. But until then, regular content and shit. Because... Because content. And I should have probably made a just-in-case save because I'm about to fuck this up. But yeah. The platforming section here and there is fine by me, and I'm not going to save. I'm, I'm, I'm going to do this pro style. There we go. So you've just got to sort of pick your way around. Don't do anything too stupid. Luckily you've got a nice high jump so this section isn't too difficult. Just as long as you're careful it shouldn't be too hard. Don't fall straight down because you will go straight through the spinny spinny blade which will give you a final. And that's all kinds of fun. Ow. Huh. And you don't want to fall too far. So I'm going to make this even easier on me and use celerity. There we go. Delicious. See, that is how you do it. That is probability there. You could have also come down the side, but I thought I'd make things interesting. What can I say? It's because I love you guys. I thought I'd, I'd show you a badass way of doing it. And then there are things like this, which... Oh, I love celerity. It is a beautiful ability. Ah! Boobies. It's... I call her boobies because of her, um, incredibly obnoxious titties. She should go down relatively quickly. I believe she'll have less health than her boss form. Naughty. Naughty's a meatsy. This meatsy are bad. I remember the first time I was down here, I basically, uh, was inept and had no idea how to play the game. And uh, I actually frenzied in here, and uh, when you frenzy you have no control, but frenzying, unlike in the surface world where it fucks you over, actually won me the section, which was kind of hilarious. Because, uh, as you know, when you go into frenzy mode, you're losing control, and it is a bad thing. It is not a good thing. If you frenzy, you are playing it wrong. Well, not necessarily. Probably means you have a low humanity score because you're a dickhead, but... Who am I to judge? Well, I, I, I am going to judge. Oh, yay, lots of... See, this section, if you go run through it like I am, it can cause you all kinds of problems. But luckily, uh, I am exploiting the game mechanics a bit, but anyway. I'll feed on those rats after I fuck her up. Because we need some health. I'll just hit her, just hit the bitch. But yeah, these are made out of multiple people, and as such are stronger, because they're bigger. Size is a direct indication of power. Oh, yeah. Size isn't everything. I don't know what I'm saying. Ah, oh, nom, 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 rats. But yes, rats are important because, yeah, blood. Blood is important. The spice must flow. This area can really fuck you over if you are of Clan Venture because your only source of blood is rats, and the Venture will um, stick their nose up at rats and go, Oh no, we can't eat that. We can't eat the rats. Don't be silly. <laughs> Tra la 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 la. Toodle pip. Says the British guy. Yeah, the Venture are stuck up bastards. I don't like them. Don't like the Venture. I like the Bruja. And uh, I'm not actually a big fan of the Toreador, to be honest. I mean, they're all a bit, you know, fruitsy and... We we love mortals. Abella, Abella, Etc, etc. Et oh, naughty. Cheeky. Let's uh, get behind them. It's, uh, I love being behind women. Just keep circling them. They shouldn't be able to fuck you up too much. And it's basically a slugging fest. Well, it's not, because they can't really turn around. And we take out another of the multi-legged bimbos. That's what they're going to be referred to from now on, multi-legged bimbos. And we need to fuck up some more rats. <laughs> As you can see, uh, I'm, I'm doing this relatively quickly and with relative ease. I know it looks like I'm losing a lot of health, but that's because I'm not really paying attention and I know there are rats around. If not, I would make more of an effort to avoid hits. I also, uh, if you look at my character sheet, have a, a relatively high stamina. In fact, I have 12. How much do I need for an extra point to stamina? There we go. Except, see, I've even leveled up. Well, I didn't level up, I just spent some character points, but... Uh, stamina is useful, because it means I can get hit in the face more, and when bitches like this be about, it's always nice to take a few more punches. 
We should be almost done. I believe in the next room we'll find the big sewer pipe, which leads to uh, Nosferatu land. And we'll have uh, done the sewer levels, and I'll be less angry because I'll have this part of the game done, which is my least favorite section. Uh, it's not that it's a bad section. It's, well, it is a bad section. The, I hate the sewers. They just they just make me want to punch a donkey. I don't know. Poor donkeys, but still. Anyway, this is the last room here. Um, any more followers? No. Okay, so we're done, basically. That's all we need. I think, anyway. Yeah. Uh, that's not a pick up that is indeed a light. Let's uh, get some more rats so I don't, you know, rage fuck and go rawr in the Nosferatu land and they'll be all like, what the fuck, dude? You're a dickhead. There we go. But now all we need to do is get into there. And to do that, we'll use the magical computer of magicalness. That's a technical term, by the way. Um, let's see. Blue screen of death. Okay, apparently we need some keycard, evidently. Evidently we need a keycard. I believe I may have missed it in the big roomy room. Oh, no I didn't. I'm not sure. Where have I missed the keycard from? Oh, joy. And it's reasons like this why I love the game. Now I'm going to make sure I've checked that room thoroughly, because I know you're probably going, it's not in there. But if it is, I will kick myself to infinity and beyond. Let's see. Um... Okay, I can't remember where that keycard is, so we're going to go back and find it. If it takes me too long, I will cut out the searching for the keycard and save it to you, but I will, I won't cut it out straight away because I might find it relatively quickly, in which case everything will be all smiles. If not, it will be all frowny face. Frowny face forever. But no, it shouldn't be too far back. Can't imagine them putting it on the other side of the map and just be like, troll, haha, we, we fucked you over. Saying that, um, that could very well be the case. I mean, uh, we killed a lot of bitches. We fucked them up with our katana. It's a nice weapon, the katana, isn't it? It's, it's a beautiful, beautiful, uh, Japanese creation. You'll probably go, actually, the katana is blah blah blah. It's a Japanese weapon, as far as I'm concerned. Why? Because I'm an ignorant white guy. <laughs> yes, that's reason enough for anything. But I believe, oh, uh, this looks promising, actually. I believe this is where we'll find our key. Because we need the key. Oh my god, I hate I hate this section so much. You have no idea how much it, this this pains me. Pains me going through these hallowed halls again. As the game sort, yeah, we'll stick a maze in because that'll be fun, right, guys? No, it is not fun. Mazes. At what point has a maze in a game been fun? They're not fun in real life. Oh my Jesus. Oh, I'll, I'll admit that was good. That was a very good jump scare. Uh, but they keep doing it all the time, so it does become a bit. Tyson. Yes, I get it. You're big. See? Ha, ah, slow attack. Fast. Me. You slow. There we go. Give, him, give the bastard his final. And hopefully we should get a keycard, which will be up here, or I'm going to murder someone. Well, I'm going to murder her anyway, but I'll murder an extra person. See, we don't do too much damage. Um, actually, I'm not sure. That I can't remember how much it's good damage anymore. Just deal as much of it as quickly as possible. There we go. Iced her. Ah, oh, I remember this as a lad. I don't. I, I was doing all the side quests when I first went through, so I don't know what the fuck I was doing in here. I mean, it's easy as shit. Saying that, I'm probably gonna get ruffle stumped, but you can't win them all. Oh my god, where, where are you, keycard? There's, there's probably someone going. It's on the floor. You're an idiot. I hate you. Go die in a hole. And that's not very nice. I, I've never asked you to go die in a hole. I think, and if I have, I apologise, but you probably deserved it, you bastard. Yeah, I got my coursework done. All 400 pages of the fucker. Never want to do that again in my life. I'll tell you that for now. Oh my god. <laughs> and of course we end up back in the room. Well, if we left it up there, then that is unfortuitous, and the game is a dickhead. But I don't think we have, I think we... We're just caught as a pawn in the, uh, maze of death. Maze of death, maze of fun and happiness. But yeah, we we need to find this keycard. Uh, I think we've almost been everywhere, and once we have seen the entirety, I will just, you know, cut this out, because you don't want to see me running through a maze. I think it's already starting to get to that point soon, but I don't really want to. <laughs> Sorry, I'm, I'm a lazy jackass, but... 
deal with it. You're watching still, therefore I'm, I'm doing something to captivate and behold your interest. Or not. More likely the latter, but... Come on. <laughs> oh, I should probably be, you know... Ah, oh, there we go. There we go. There we go, that's what I was looking for, huh? Okay. Uh... That was a Nosferatu. I think we could have saved her, but I was not quick enough. There we go. Uh, hope, and that's the key card we've been looking for. There we go. And now we can grab this key card and open the door. There we go. Pass key gained. Huzzah! Uh, sh I'll check over here just in case. Give it a quick left and right. And of course, there are more of these overweight cunts. I love being able to dodge. Ow. <laughs> Saying that he gets hit because I, he, it, man face is annoying. There we go. Destroyed him. And we're done with the area. All we need to do now is return to the point of uh, key cardness. It's a word, trust me. I'm a doctor of doctorology as I've told you multiple times and I believe is important information you should all know. Ah, uh, yes. Ah. Uh. Uh, we're almost there. We're almost there, gents. Almost there. Yes, this is the, as I keep saying, the least favorite section of the game. Not fun. Not fun compared to other bits. It's no lolzing up in Chinatown. No kicking down corrupt organizations. It is just... The sewer level. <laughs> every game has... Well, not every game has one, if you're going to get technical, but... Games have sewer levels, and I'm going to have to deal with it. Oh, uh, and my mouse is fucking up because it's really sensitive and there is a hair on the lens of the mouse. There we go. There we go, fantastic. Mouse, bad. I'm clearing gunk out of the mouse. I, I, I thought that was important for you to know. There we go, there we go. Deary me, deary me, mouse. Anyway, we... I love that. Clan Toreador. Of all the clans, Toreador are the most connected to the mortal world. Okay, fine. Fuck you then, game. Unlike the camera, the, the Sabot recognizes the existence of antediluvians. Yes, antediluvians are very fun. They are old vampires who are all like, Rawr, we're old, I'm getting angry at you damn kids, you bastards. Because that's how I imagine an antediluvian sounding. Oh, I can't see shit. Um, discipline's not allowed. Okay, fair enough. Okay, I can see shit now. But I was trying to use Orpex, because if it's dark, you want to use Orpex, I'm going to... into first-person mode. Because we shouldn't be encountering... damn bins and pathfinding, but yes, this is the home of the Nosferatu, and I, I love it. <laughs> you can hear the whispers, it's beautiful, to be honest. I might turn the volume up here a bit, just so you can hear the whispers. But I mean, look at it, it's... I love it. <laughs> I, I I can't express the joy I felt as a child after going through that coming into an area like this. It's, I, 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 it's hard to explain the emotion this brings back, actually. <sighs> I love this area. Sorry, I, I, I know you're probably thinking, oh, he's gushing, but... It's an area that's worthy of gushing, if I'm honest. I mean, I have no idea why I love it so much. It's, uh, it just brings back so many memories. I believe that water's boiling, or is poisonous, or something, so you don't want to stand in it. That's why I hopped over that little bit. But we are looking for Gary. And there are actually a lot of Nosferatu here, but you don't see him on the first time through, because Nosferatu hide a lot. It's their, it's their shindig, their dealio. Uh, no, we're not going through that door. It's one of these doors, but this is where all the Nosferatu live. I like the Nosferatu. I don't like playing as them, but I have to admit, I do like them. Just try to run a trace on me. All right, take that. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I hope you backed up that server tonight. Boss is gonna be real pissed when his mom starts getting love letters from porn sites. <sighs> <laughs> this is why I love the Nosferatu. It's things like this. It's the shit they do. Um, hello. What? Oh, yeah. Hold on a sec. Oh my god, 
Are you kidding me? What are you using for security down there at Trash 80? <laughs> Guys, it's called encryption. This is too easy. I'd let you off the hook, but stupidity always brings out the asshole in me. <laughs> um, uh, hey there. Uh, all right, yeah. Just one minute. No, 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 nothing to worry about. Just a harmless email. Not a self-replicating embedded virus or anything. <laughs> <laughs> wow, you really opened it. I can't believe you just opened it. What kind of a freaking idiot just opens it? Maybe I'll come back later. Well, oh yeah, sorry. The name's Mitnick. I'm in charge of computer systems, network security, that kind of thing. You're the new kid, right? The Croix boy. Surprised you actually made it down here. <laughs> oh, I'm not here for small talk. I'm looking for Gary. Yeah, he knows why you're here. LaCroix must be pissed. But I hope you're not here looking for some payback. LaCroix knows better than to mess with Gary, sheriff or no sheriff. I'm just here to talk. Where can I find him? His room is just down the hall. You'll probably find him there. Or maybe he'll find you. <laughs> oh, Gary is a lovely fellow, but we'll meet him in due time. I'll go find him. See ya. Uh, yeah, he's a nice guy. I do like him as a character. Although, Gary's one of the more interesting characters of the game. We're, we're going to meet Mr. Gary. So, uh, who doesn't want to meet Gary? Everyone loves Gary. Uh, we could talk to him. I'd much rather see Gary. I'll just see Gary and then come back for these people. Oh, where is you? Where is you? Where is you? Where are you, Gary? Uh, oh, Gary. Gary kids. You need to find him. Gary is, uh, is the reason we're here. No, that's not it. That's the way out. That's the way out, but we need to stay in Ghoul City. That's what I'm calling it. I can't remember what the technical town of the city was, but as far as I'm concerned, this is Ghoul City. We need to find Mr. Gary, because Gary is uh, why we're here, as I've said multiple times. I love the whispers. But then again, I do love a bit of insanity. Okay, I can't appear to be... I don't appear to be finding my way very well here. Because as much as I love the area, it's a bit confusing. It's not actually that confusing once you remember where everything is and the way it's laid out. But uh, as you can see, the layout is scattered at best. Oh, this was the door, of course. I think. Was it? Nope. <laughs> not here. That was not the door. Uh, it is one of these doors, I assure you. That's her... Jesus, I'm sorry, I can't remember the right door. Um, which way? He said it was just down the hall, didn't he? Oh, maybe I'll talk to that lady face. Maybe she knows where Gary is, and that's uh, her technical term for a woman, people, a lady face. Bitch! I can't believe she got the cover of Glamorella this month! Sorry, uh, maybe I came at a bad time. I mean, just look at her! Too fat, big teeth in her complexion! Does she wash her face with a cheese grater? <laughs> Calm down, Calgo. What exactly are we talking about here? I mean, like anyone ever knew who Tawny Sessions was before I left the scene, she'd still be a fluff girl at Vivisection, making ten bucks a stiff if I'm still around. <sighs> who the hell is Tawny Sessions? Tawny Sessions is a wannabe face girl with no talent whatsoever and scabby little knees. Do you know she got model of the year before I got here? She would have had a hard time making the catalog for Jacques Penet. Oh, that tiny... Um, no. That's a good one. Uh, who are you, by the way? Oh, right. You probably don't recognize me with this whole Texas Chainsaw Massacre thing I've got going on here. My name is... Imalia. Oh, let's see. I'm looking for Gary. Do you know where he is? His room is just down the hall. You might be able to find him in there. I'll see if I can find him. See ya. Just down the hall. Just uh, just uh, It's not specific enough, you damn ho face. Is this the room you're talking about? There's no Gary here. See, it's just Gimbal. Oh yeah, I remember Gimbal. That sounds actually quite funny. It's details like that that make me laugh. It's just down the hall. Which down the hall? There are multiple hallways. Directions, lady. Give. 
Okay, well, I'm, I'm going to assume it's over the bridge, even though I think that's the way out of this hellhole. Uh, if we don't find him soon, I'm going to end the video and be all like, Done, lol. Well, I, I, I can't imagine I'll say it like that, but still. Just hop out, you. There we go. Good boy. Good boy. Oh, no, it was at the end. I'm such an idiot. I'm a lovable idiot, though. But that's the door we're looking for. Yes, I get it whispering. How quaint. This is the door we're looking for. As you can see, all of this is stolen from different areas around the game. And we are entering Gary's domain. By the clack smack cracking of my thumbs, something wicked this way comes. I don't remember seeing you on the guest list for the dinner party. We're having a rap party for the misfits about 40 years late. Cast and crew only, boss. And this is, uh, Gary. Show yourself. Maybe I'm in your head. Uh-oh, you might have picked up one of those psychoses so common to new kindred. I just need to talk to you. Now come out, or I'll shove my fist up your rectum and strangle you with your own spine. We are talking, but you aren't listening, boss. I don't like games. You're used to getting what you want, aren't you, handsome? People just love your charisma, your face. They eat your words up like the rats eat the cheese in the trap. Oh, boss, where do you think you are? Who are you? Maybe I'm a ghost. <laughs> oh, come on, don't tell me you just stumbled down here. What I need to know is why you're here. Um, let's see. Let's talk, face to face. I'm over here, boss. Wait, maybe I'm over here. Or maybe I'm behind you with a hatchet in my hand. Or did you ever stop to think that your fear, if given a voice, would sound like this? No, I'm pretty sure my fear embodied would sound slightly different. What do you want? <laughs> I want to stick your lovely face in a piranha tank. I want to apply an acid glaze to your sculptured body. I want to throw your pocket mirror under a thresher and watch you fetch it. But I'm no butcher, boss. Are you? I'm here for the Ankaran sarcophagus. You don't say. Wake up, boss. Who do you think you're dealing with? Why else would LaCroix send you on this snipe hunt? Oh, that's right. I know you work for the Prince. Why did you ask then? Because I like the sound of my own voice. It's not every day we get visitors, boss. I needed to hear it from you. You're a long way from home, and neither the Prince, nor Isaac, nor Nines have any domain down here. Tread carefully. Bite me. Who are you? Just show yourself, you... See. Are you sure, boss? You don't want my image in your subconscious. It's the stuff nightmares are made of. Yes, come out. Actually, the suspense is killing me. Careful what you wish for. You just might get it. <laughs> So, this is, um, Gary. You're the most offensive and obscene thing I've ever seen. Oh God, Toreador! You vain, glorious, narcissistic poser! How I loathe that determination of your kind to belie your true nature with Paris fashions and pomp! You are a dead thing, a creature of the shadows. Start acting like one. So, uh, this is a very interesting aspect of the game. Depending on your character, conversations will change, and Nosferatu despised the Toreador because, as you can imagine, Toreador, they embrace their mortality, and, uh, as such, are very pretty and gentle, while they're scum and look scummy. Well, they're not scum, I actually quite like them, I prefer them to the Toreador, but I figure we'll keep up our prejudice. Jealous? Do you miss the surface? Do you miss your face? Actually, I feel like a bit of a dick. Who are you? What? You don't recognize me from the pictures? Gorgeous Gary Golden? 
Don't tell me you missed Pirate Town or Tap Hotel. A little before your time, eh, boss? Well, those days are long past. Nowadays, it's just Gary. Delighted. Now, where's the sarcophagus? Where, where, where did it go? That thing seems to get around more than May West. Why might I ask, should I give you that information? Oh, yeah, and he's a bit bitchy with his, and do you get around more than May West? <laughs> I'm under the orders of the prince. Actually, no, because I've got rid of the Zemitsi for you. Oh, my hero. Had it not been for that damn Shamisi, you'd still be searching under rocks for us. It was hardly a favor, but... I know where your prince's prize is. There's very little that doesn't leak down into this place. Tell me, boss, you ever gone up against a Kuei Jin? What's a Kuei Jin? I know what Kuei Jin are, but I'm asking for your benefit. The Kuei Jin are vampires, but not like kindred. Sometimes known as the Vampires of the East. But they ain't kin, boss. They're just someone else that, if you ain't being careful, might give you the final death. Mm -hmm. Tell me more! Even for old Gary, there ain't much more to tell. You see, I sent an agent, Barabbas, to snoop around Chinatown, do a little hacking, make a few contacts. But he hasn't been calling lately, and it's breaking my heart. And let me guess, you want me to find him? Gee, that's original. You think that up all by yourself? You up for a little trip to Chinatown? You're in no danger there. Me. <laughs> Best you don't mention my name there, boss. That's the going rate for my info right now. You get our chum back from Chinatown. I'll give you what you need. Deal. Tell me what I need to do. The Golden Temple in Chinatown. It's a piss-poor copy of a real place. Looks like it'd be more at home in a theme park. That I saw is where you'll find the leader of the L.A. Kuei Jin. They call her Ming Zhao. Sounds dangerous? No, this ain't a suicide mission, boss. You'll be more of a curiosity than a threat. Talk to Zhao. Ask her where my boy is and get him back. Once he's safe, I'll tell you everything you need to know about the sarcophagus. All right, I'll go. But you better keep up your end of the deal. Of course. What kind of a monster do you take me for? <laughs> there is a method to my madness, boss. There's a payphone in Chinatown. I'll call you with the info once Barabbas is safe. Until then, you'll never know where I am. Uh, I don't know why I didn't talk. Uh, just get by. Miss Bye. me, boss? Yes, actually. Now let's let's leave this place. So we're going to go and uh, head up to the surface. There were multiple side quests we could have had in there, but again, I'm leaning to the side of let's get on with it and get this done because there's too much pussy footing around. We need to charge forth and get to the taxi. I'll end at the taxi because it's a nice place to end. Because next time we get to go to Chinatown after having dealt with Gary and seen some more plot, we fought some nice overweight men and. Booby women. Uh, it's been fun. We've we've had good times. But I guess you're wondering where you are. I bet you're thinking, where the hell is this place? Well, we couldn't get here before because the area was blocked. But we are in the cemetery. Uh, that would be more impressive when I open the door and that will like fun happen together. Yes, we're in the cemetery. You can no clip and skip out the whole section. I remember that. I remember no clipping through there because I was like, oh, not this bit again. Fuck it. Bye. Because I uh, I really don't like that section of the game, and it's done now. It's done, and I'm 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 never going back there again. Because uh, as much as I like this game, I think this may be my final playthrough of it. Because I don't know. Uh, until I come back in like another ten years and be like, I remember this game. Oh my god, which is what I'm like now. But uh, yeah, that was one of my favorite areas and one of my worst, right next to each other. Funny that. But yes, we get to deal with the Quasian next, and the Quasian are uh, a lot less vampiric than even the Toreador. Although, um, yeah. Yeah, and Nosferatu and hate me and because I'm pretty. That's pretty much long and short of it. And actually, because I don't really want to go through another loading screen, 
this has been Elkman001, and thank you for watching.